Greetings, I am Harry Larry from Gary, and this is episode 1089 of The Sims 4 Gallery Lots. And this particular lot is called Wicked Whims Strip Club. It is on a 30 by 30 lot type nightclub, and boop, there is a description you're more welcome to read. Now, I don't have Wicked Whims, because I play on the PlayStation, so I don't have that mod. So I can't fully test out everything, but... And unfortunately for me, these lights right here are not working. They're moving back and forth, but they're not lit up. So, I was kind of saddened by that, but... Yeah, these photos are kind of hard really to see. What you got going on here? You can tell a couple of things, but... Never fear, we're going to go take a look at the real thing here. Right now. Looks like there is a back door. Alright, let's go down and take a look around. place does look pretty cool though. And you will not see anything really inappropriate here that you would not see playing The Sims. Even though my content is not made for children. Even though I'm kind of friendly that way, though, but... Ooh. Let's go take a look at this in a moment. That looks really cool. Nice. Like a good bubbler. Ooh, which way should we go? Left or right? Where are you going, Lars? And yeah, I had to put Blondie in something. I was debating should I uh, put Blondie up there or Lars? And since I'm a guy, Blondie's up there. looking club. And before we go any farther, whoops, Let's see if I can find, yeah, gotta love mirrors. And yes, I am waving, you are more than welcome to wave back, or not. Okay, let's get a little closer look up here. So, Blondie had to she didn't walk all the way through this way. She walked up these stairs right here. Yeah, this place is really pretty. Oh, and that is a light for the stripper pole. was a look. I guess he's happy. Let's get a little corner to corner. 
Yeah, duffel bags of money everywhere here. I do not know where he's going. And no, I did not check every chair here. I just picked random ones that look like maybe it wouldn't work, but every one I have checked, it does work. Beautiful looking bar. Definitely like the look of this place. Probably one of my favorite uh, nightclubs yet I've seen. And not just because of the strip bar. At first when I seen this uh, room I was kind of wondering if it was uh, the lap dance room but I guess it's where they change clothes. I do like the look of this place. Okay, let me find how I get to other places. Oh, and before I forget, right behind here, there was just a little extra storage area. So I thought that was kind of cool. One last look behind. Yeah, definitely a beautiful looking bar. Ooh, there's a door. I almost missed it. I guess I found the back door. Definitely look like you're going to get jumped out here. Alright, that was pretty cool. And I know there should be another... But there she is. In the office. types of money going on here.
right, let's go up to the second floor and take a look around. Very cool. All right, before we go th through those doors, we'll come on over here. Take a look at the bathroom, but first, yeah, that little corner looks really pretty. Nice bathroom. room. I guess the side to side. This I thought was really ingenious as well. I thought it looked really nice. Looks like I keep on going through a wall over there. Now I see why. And they do have little smoke or fog things going on underneath here, so I thought that was kind of cool. Yeah, definitely a fan of that. That's really cool. Oh, we got our private masseuse. pronounce that pretty well, huh? I like that far wall over there with all the purple mirrors. That looks pretty cool. Alright, let's go on through here. Nice little hot tub area. Every time I still say hot tub, I always think of Eddie Murphy's doing his dream brown Im imita imitation. Impersonation. That's it. When he's saying about a hot tub. <laughs> Not too. Nice little sauna room, though. Yeah, this place is pretty cool. Alright, let's bounce out and uh, take a closer look at this lot. <coughs> and, as always, if you ended up enjoying this lot and our video, you're more than welcome to give it a thumbs up. I don't know what that little white thing is, but... Oh, looks like uh, little bubbles. I don't know from where, though. Hmm. Too early in the season to be snow. And if you en end up enjoying watching my videos and you're not a subscriber, you are more welcome to subscribe and, of course, hit that notification bell or button, whichever you prefer. Why may you ask? Because normally I publish three videos a day. Two from the gallery lots and one from Maxis lots. Right now I'm just about ready to finish up my wedding stories. We're doing some of those bonus lots you find in your own personal My Library. So well, those are kind of cool. If you have anything to say, you're more welcome as well to put a 
comment in the comment section. And if you know anybody who would enjoy seeing this video, you can share it. Ha, I bet you were hoping I would say you're more than welcome. Yeah, I gotta change it up every now and then. Definitely a pretty lot. And, of course, the most important thing of all, please take a look at this Creator's Other Creations. And with that happy thought, let's go for a top-down view. Well, as you can tell, there's no problem whatsoever with the ceilings. If you were kind of wondering. Okay. I was looking at the glass window, seeing if there was one above it, but there is not. Ooh, you definitely have a room to play with if you so desire. Yeah, this was definitely nicely made. And by somebody who actually has been to a strip club. By the looks of it. Except no VIP room. Hmm, huh, I guess that makes me sound like I've been to one or two before in my life. Eh, I got no comment. Yeah, that looked really pretty cool. And definitely you can put little secret rooms around here if you so desire. Little walkways, watch people. And there is no basement here. Mm, let's see if I can find a perfect spot to showcase this off. I guess I'm going to go front end. Very rare do I do this. Alright. Hopefully I'll catch you on the next episode. And until then. Later.